Typhoon Haiyan uh, has made landfall in the Philippines, where it's known locally as Yolanda, which is quite a harmless sounding name, but this typhoon is far from harmless. It's the strongest tropical cyclone so far this year and one of the most intense on record. As of 8 a.m. local time this morning, Haiyan made its third landfall over the Cebu province. Um, at that stage, maximum sustained winds are t up to 215 kilometers per hour near the center, with gusts up to 250 kilometers per hour. In the last uh, three months, in addition to the Bohol earthquake, um, the emergency authorities uh, and, and the uh, humanitarian community has actually been faced by uh, now three major humanitarian emergencies. So uh, there are also some 75,000 people still displaced in Zamboanga, uh, in Mindanao, in the southern Philippines. Um, and in Bohol, uh, there are still an estimated 350,000 people uh, displaced and living in temporary shelters following the earthquake. WFP resources are currently stretched. Uh, we are already assisting people affected by the earthquake in Bohol province, as well as those displaced by fighting in Zamboanga, in addition to our regular operations uh, in Mindanao. We uh, need urgently $2 million for the immediate needs of an initial 500,000 people to buy 2,000 metric tons of rice and 40 tons of high energy biscuits.